Previously on Stay the Night. I found a check-in for Christina Williams. Dating back three weeks ago. And using Ditto's address as the home address. It, do you have something on you? Is that somebody we can call for you? I got these. I got these. I met a lady at Ditto. She gave me the strangest feeling that she knew me somehow. Well, she knew that Chrissy had a husband. Listen, just tell your family. I'm sure they'll be thrilled to know that what they thought they, they've lost, that they haven't lost at all. Cha Cha, everybody. It's me, Chrissy. And now we continue with Stay the Night. Corrupting this baby. You better stop for I tell Mr. Gall. Go ahead and tell Mr. Gall, I'm not corrupting anybody. I'm giving this young man a financial education. And street craps. We got to start somewhere. First, we're talking the main streets, we're talking the side streets, and then we have Wall Street. We got to crawl for we walk. No, uh, uh, no, no crawling, walking, nothing. How much money oh, did you take God. from this baby? About twelve dollars. Don't you feel smarter now, son? Twelve dollars. Give me this baby. Give me this. Oh, would you get your head out of my? Pocket? It never ends with you two. Always starting trouble. No, she didn't. Who does she think she is? I know she ain't talking to me. Get your head out of my. Give me. I ain't got your money. I ain't got your money. Come here. Stop me, baby. Come on. Like riding a bike, huh? See? It's all coming back to you. Mm hmm. Just one thing, though. Yes. Whenever you're manning the front desk, you can't leave the old skeleton key laying around. Oh, God, did I do that? I'm sorry. Well, I know, I found it in the kitchen of all places. We just have to be more careful. That's all. You know, I went in there earlier for a snack. Mm -hmm. I must have forgotten it. Please forgive me. Oh. Please, it's nothing to forgive. There's nothing to forgive. We just have to remember. Just be more careful. Matter of fact, don't even worry about it. What I want you to do is just put it on your key ring so that you always have it with you. you That's know, the best way. That is a good idea. <laughs> Cha Cha, yeah. I just want to thank you. You have been so good to me through all this process. Yes, Chrissy, please. Ditto is your home. I know. It's my pleasure. You've been so sweet. What in the world did you get this heifer from? Sweet she, uh, no, she ain't been here but a week and she already started trouble. Oh, that woman is your boss, Chrissy. Show some respect. Listen, she never did give me that five dollar raise. I think it was ten. So before her little accident. Okay, oh, mama, she didn't promise you no raise. She was about to fire you for stealing toilet paper, woman. No, she oh, was. Really? No, she, no, was. she wasn't about to get fired for no Thank toilet God. paper. Right. It was those little soaps that oh. she was stealing. Yeah, that's, that's what, what it was. was. <laughs> <laughs> what Hi. Um, I was looking under my bathroom sink for some cleaning supplies, and 
I couldn't find any. Do you guys sell those kinds of things here? Oh, look, now y'all got the guests doing work. No, it's nothing like that. Actually, the room was immaculate when I checked in, so I just yeah. want to be sure that I leave it the way I found it. Okay. So what did you do? Oh, sweet. Oh, wow. <laughs> there was a slow drain in the tub, and I unclogged it. So when I did, it just sort of left the tub looking a little unkept. Hi, my name is Ms. Witt. And what is your name? Look, oh, wait, 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 I got this one. Look, this is Unicorn, and my name is Sweet Mama Child. Sweet Mama. <laughs> <laughs> Baby, how have you been enjoying your stay here? It's been great, thank you. Good, I'm so glad you're enjoying it. <laughs> thank Look, you. Look, I'm going to show her the cleaning supply. Do you know how to make some corn pone? Mm -hmm. That's all right, I'm going to show you how to do okay. it. Okay. <laughs> Everybody, have a seat, please. Have a seat. Have a seat. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Have a seat. Have a seat. Now for this next exercise, I want all of you to close your eyes. Come on, let's get them closed. I want you looking at the inside of your eyelids, okay? Now, do you see how quiet it got? That's because instinctively when your eyes can't see, your ears, they want to hear everything that they can. See, that's why we shut our mouths so we can listen. But a lot of y'all running around here blind as a bat, your mouths running a mile a minute. You are refusing to listen. So now, Let's just keep our eyes closed a minute longer. And hold a minute from the Yeah, just, just look. Just relax. Concentrate. I want all of you to think about what makes you happy. The first thing that pops in your head. Whatever it is that makes you happy. Think on that. Anything? Anything. So what are you thinking? What makes you happy? I'm thinking about Disneyland. Bro, shut. Oh, you know that ain't well, you ain't never been to no business. Bro, so it's happiest place on earth, man. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. All right, all right. Bro, I'm not, I'm not All right. We need to get on the okay. race. Well, let's just get rid of that dragon breath again. Let's hear some more. What else makes you happy? I love cars, specifically fast ones, like a Bugatti, a McLaren, and especially a Maserati. You ain't seen my car yet. Right. Mm -hmm. Look at this man ain't even got a bike. I do have a bike. What handlebars? Bro, the ball car makes me happy. Okay. Oh, shut up. I'm for a ski. You can't bike. It don't matter what movie I watch. It reminds me of the weekend with my dad. Basketball makes me happy. Okay. And football. And checkers. <laughs> my mom, my sister, my aunts, my grandma, and great grandma makes me happy. <laughs> okay. Now I want y'all to notice something. Not a one of you, and I mean not a one of you, said anything about fighting or stealing. Or making money. Or guns, or drugs, or jail. I was gonna say that, but I can't see my dad until 2019. Well, let me ask you this. Why do you think we spend so much time doing what doesn't make us happy. Anyone? Christian. Honestly, Mr. Gardner, I think sometimes what you gotta do what doesn't make us happy. Because it's the right thing to do. If someone is mad. Uh, 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 anyone else? Anyone else? Where did that come from? All right, guys, like what you're seeing on the show? Fantastic. Because we'll show you where we got it and where you can get it. All you have to do is go to Shop the Show, at www.staythenight.org. You can get anything ranging from what we're wearing to what we're driving. And while you are at the website, why don't you go ahead and take a few extra seconds and put in the Who Said It contest.
who said stay the night in each episode. The person at the end of the season with the most correct answers is going to win a bedroom makeover from Belk at Friendly Shopping Center. So we look forward to seeing you there. I really got to give it to them surgeons. They really gave you a nice replacement face. What did you have to do? Uh, pick one out of a book or have them go and make Oh my God, meat? Uncle Graham, no. Oh, cha cha, you never know when I might need a new replacement face. <laughs> what do an old barracuda need a new face for? <laughs> no, no. It's okay. We're all family. You see, Uncle Grip, after the accident, I was broken and burned pretty bad. It took months of surgery and rehab before I could even remember my own name. So what is your name? Christina. No, sugar, your real name. Sweet mama. Sweet mama. So look, just write it down, whatever it is. What if we don't have any goals? Well, see, that's why we're doing this. Young brother, mm -hmm. everybody has goals daily goals, but it's up to you to accomplish those goals. Just like this morning when you woke up, besides saying your prayers, your first goal, I hope, was to brush your teeth right. Well, you can stop hoping, because we all know that was a fail. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit, I wrote your Mickey Mouse tail. Come on, Spell Mickey Mouse. 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 All right. I, uh, all right. right. See, so y'all don't think <laughs> this is funny. Okay, yeah. but I'm here to tell you that it's not. And I'm, you know what, I'm going to tell you something else too. And I don't care if you run home and tell your mama because you're not too young to hear this. The street corners, prison cells, graveyards are full of boys and men who didn't have any goals. Well, not just us. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, hold on. Hold on here. Hold on. Young man. Do you see any girls in this room? Okay, so look, we're not going to be worrying about the girls right now. He is. But what well, you got there, Christian? Yeah. Nothing, Mr. Gordon. Uh, do you care to explain yourself, brother? I'm not thinking about anybody. Think about my goals too, Mr. Gordon. Uh -huh. <laughs> mm -hmm. Hold up. Hello. Yes, I am. No, you not. Wait. This is a serious matter. This man can have his phone, and I can't. Uh, you, can, you can. You can go back and have a seat. Go on back, have a seat. Go on back, have a seat. Have a seat. Have a seat. Mr. Gardner, this is Sabrina. Let me take this real quick. Okay. Hey, You know something? Y'all ain't got no money. Okay? And if you don't have any money, then you ain't got no business being worried with no girls. You better have some goals. So, okay, so let's start writing. Now! And it reminded me so much of the church that I used to go to. And then flashes of Greenwood Point began to come back. And the facility that I was staying in, they helped me piece things back together, like Chris. Oh, it's just amazing. Praise mm. God. You know, I cannot wait to call him and give him the video. Oh, wait, look, wait a minute. What song? Huh? You heard me. What song remind you of our church? Sweet mama, you leave Chrissy alone asking her all these questions. No, no one on the real, it was probably Rick James. <laughs> Our God is an awesome God, He reigns from heaven above with wisdom, power, and love. Our God is an awesome God. Girl, bye. Every church know that song. That didn't even mean nothing. <laughs> no, 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 Chrissy, she did love that song. I mean, truly, she loved when the choir sang that song. So, 
She did love that song. That was one of her favorites. Cha uh, Cha, I'm right here. No, you ain't feeling tired. You're right, Chrissy. I'm sorry. You do love when the choir sings this. Okay, let me ask you something. Where's your husband? You do remember your husband, don't you? Hey, Mom. What? Why do you think she's here? What is wrong with her? Oh, she just mad because she thinks Chrissy, Chrissy killed her nephew. <laughs> That's all that is. No, she doesn't. You know, I think it's really time I get ready to give Chris a call. I think um, so. Chaka, yeah. can I yeah. talk to you for a minute? Intoxicating. Invigorating. All right, guys, like what you're seeing on the show? Fantastic, because we'll show you where we got it and where you can get it. All you have to do is go to Shop the Show at www.staythenight.org. You can get anything ranging from what we're wearing to what we're driving. And while you are at the website, why don't you go ahead and take a few extra seconds and put in the Who Said It contest. Who said Stay the Night in each episode? The person at the end of the season with the most correct answers is going to win a bedroom makeover from Belk at Friendly Shopping Center. So we look forward to seeing you there. Cha-Cha, do you think that's such a good idea? What? Calling Chris. I do. In fact, I uh, already... Uh, uh, excuse me. I'm sorry to interrupt y'all. I need you to go down there to that room and tell your crooked toe boyfriend that I need that room for my Bible study. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I forgot. I, I know you that. did. Come on, let's go. I'm, bye, baby. I'll get back with you in a few minutes. Oh. I forgot all about that. I'll get it straightened out for you. I'll get. Christian? Are you okay? Yeah. I don't believe no. Christian. You don't find this really. Adam May, let me get back with you in a few minutes. I want to know what's going on, too. Adam May, let me get back with you in a few minutes. I know she didn't just talk to me yes. like that. Yes. I tell you what, you just better get my room straight. Hey, Christian. Well, I need some prayer. Okay. Work out some feelings I'm having. What kind of feelings? Well, the natural feelings, just not pure. They're not right. Not pure? Okay, yeah. who is she? I promise you won't tell anybody. Christian, you know me better than that. Who is she? It's Cha Cha, Miss Whip. I think I'm in love. <sighs> Have you prayed about this? All the time. Look, let's pray. Father, in the matchless name of Jesus, we come thanking you. We give you thanks for all that you do, God. And we're asking you right now, Lord, to change these feelings that Christian is having. Lord, we know these feelings are not of you. They are not pure feelings, and anything that is not pure does not come from you. We're asking you right now, God, to just change those feelings, Lord. Lord, I put Christian into your hands. I put the situation into your hands, Lord. That anything you do, let us be ready to receive it and let him know that this is not of you and he can let it go in Jesus' mighty and precious name. Amen. Amen. Is that her? Her who? That lady from the show. Nah, that's not her. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Guys, no, it's not. guys. 
what you're thinking is true. Actually, I am. So that is me, mama! Stanley, he's a night manager, and he will give you a great deal. He loves pretty women, and Devin, he will give you probably seven. Oh, I'm so. definitely yeah, asking. Chris, you're home. Um, excuse me. Chris, how are you? I'm fine, Cha Cha. It's good Chris. to be back. Chris, my baby. Hey, sweet mama, how are hey, you? Hey, just in time, cook the big pot of corn pone. Oh. We're gonna go fix yourself. Hey, wait, 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 wait. Oh, Chris, you, you, you know Devin, I guess? Oh, Chris and I are just friends. He actually told me about this place. Yeah, I told her all about Ditto's. And she decided to stay the night. Well, that is until a room opened up at Donovan's Hotel. You know what, actually, that's a good idea. Well, why don't you go ahead and take her on over? You know how those rooms fill up over at Donovan's. Chris, my man, you back, buddy? Hey, Uncle Girl, oh, how you doing? Lord. We're uh -huh. gonna get together later on, All kid. right, all right. <laughs> uh, so, <laughs> weird how Donovan's Hotel is actually good for business. Donovan's so, Hotel. I know, weird, right? So, so why don't you go ahead and take her and get her all checked in Listen, over there? I'm all set and ready to go if you're ready. You sure? Yeah, yeah. All right, well, I'm gonna go get her checked in and I'll good, good. be back later. Come on. Uh, wait a minute, tell me how y'all met. I cannot believe what I just saw. Can you believe he had the nerve to come here with another woman? Cha cha. How you expect for him not to go on with his life? He's a young man, and he got needs. What he's got is a wife. Does he? Ye yes, he does. You know what, and I don't know why y'all keep treating Chrissy this way. Bless her little heart. All right, guys, like what you're seeing on the show? Fantastic, because we'll show you where we got it and where you can get it. All you have to do is go to Shop the Show at www.staythenight.org. You can get anything ranging from what we're wearing to what we're driving. And while you are at the website, why don't you go ahead and take a few extra seconds and put in the Who Said It contest. Who said Stay the Night in each episode? The person at the end of the season with the most correct answers is going to win a bedroom makeover from Belk at Friendly Shopping Center. So we look forward to seeing you there. Is that her? Her who? That lady from the show. Nah, that's not her. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Guys, no, it's not. guys, what you're thinking is true. Actually, I am. So that is me, mama! Next time on Stay the Night. Best case scenario, dealing with a twisted sense of humor. But worst case, murder. Murder? I see you back, finally. Yeah, I'm back. No, well, maybe this is for the best. I mean, we weren't in a good place before the accident. And since I've been with you, Devin, I'm not even sure I know my wife anymore. You know, a friend of mine used to do that. Cree is her name. Cree. Well, that's what I called her anyway. I love that name. Mm -hmm. So you've heard her name before? <laughs> yeah. Chrissy. And now it's time for our African American moment. notorious for their afros, dark apparel, and willingness for armed self-defense. 
but their manifesto for change launched programs that benefited communities nationwide, like free dental care, breakfast for low-income children, and even drama classes. Police are there not to, uh, in our community, not to uh, promote our welfare or uh, for our security and our safety, but they're there to contain us, brutalize us, and murder us. This frightened the government because this was the unity between the most oppressed of the people in the United States. We did what the government would not do, and they were absolutely afraid and said we were the most dangerous, the most threatening to the internal security of the United States. As the party grew, we were more and more stalked and surveilled by the FBI. All power to the people! We changed language. We changed social order. We talked about the power that we hold. Our slogan, all power to the people, changed the way people thought about themselves. We were motivated by love for the people. Alrighty, fellas, alrighty then. Y'all get right. Tell me to get my money back.